short statement. We have stood up for what we believe in and it will soon be time for the judge to make his ruling. While we were in court, the Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change met in Japan. It is likely that they will publish their report on Monday. This report is the culmination of four years' work by hundreds of experts around the world. The report will address the impacts of climate change and how we must adapt to survive. We believe that this report will provide further context and justification for, the pe for people to peacefully protest against fracking. Fracking will not lower fuel, bill fuel bills, it will not give us energy security, and it will not create a significant number of jobs. Fracking will accelerate climate change, pollute our environment, and it is an economic dead end. David Cameron must listen to the scientists rather than his ministers and advisers who work for Quadrilla and the oil industry. Finally, we would really like to thank all of the supporters who have come to the court and the thousands who have sent messages of support. Thank you. That's Caroline and a couple of the others are way back inside the court for a debrief with their lawyers after what has been a quite successful week so far. It's continuing on the 17th of April at 11 o'clock or 10.30 for 11 o'clock for the fifth of the five defendants that were appearing this week. Uh, the fifth defendant still hasn't given testimony herself for her own case. Uh, after that will be the final summations and then the judgment by the court. There's been a couple of setbacks where the court have not allowed witness testimony from a, an expert witness. It was the only outside witness being called by any of the defendants and he himself was called by all of the defendants. It was Kevin Anderson, a, an anti-fracking expert and we're quite surprised that the court refused to have him speak but then again in hindsight would they actually want an expert in a high court giving testimony about fracking so that we hope will happen another day but tonight's Friday it's beer o'clock and I'm off ski I will speak to you guys soon the other events around Brighton if there are any please get in touch and I'll cover as much as I can whilst here but from the law courts at Brighton